In this video, I'm going to share with you five simple techniques to last longer in bed that you can use the next time you have sex. Nothing advanced required here. The thing you have to do with these five simple techniques is just remember to use them. Starting with number one, which might seem overly simple, but I promise you the impact of this is massive, and it is to empty your bladder before sex. A full bladder will create pressure and tension in your genital region, and this pressure and tension will push you towards ejaculation. It's as simple as that. And if you're starting to be sexual and you've forgotten and you realize you have to pee, just take a pause and go relieve your bladder. You'll be surprised at the impact that this can have. Technique number two is to relax your pelvic floor and glute muscles. This is huge. The key to lasting as long as you want in bed is relaxation especially in your pelvic floor. And this is why a lot of guys get really surprised if they've done a lot of Kegels and they still suffer from premature ejaculation. It's because they haven't unwound those Kegels and they're tight in their pelvic floor. They might be tight in their glute muscles as well. So uh, come into some relaxation there. A trick to doing this well is to extend foreplay and consciously pay attention to your pelvic floor and your glute muscles during foreplay to make sure they're relaxed, to make sure that carries with you into penetrative sex. Technique number three, do sexual breath work. What do I mean by that? I mean, as soon as you start having sex, start breathing deeply. That's what I do. I do that for at least 20 breaths and then I make that a practice. I used to say just breathe deeply during sex, but people didn't really get the importance of what I was talking about. So now I've started to say do sexual breath work. And it won't feel natural at first because you're going to be putting effort into this, extra effort, but I promise you it's worth it. And if you've ever done intensive breath work or a Wim Hof breath work session, you know that after 20 full breaths like that, uh, your system just feels so much more open and there's a different consciousness and different physiology happening in your body. And what this does is it allows for sexual pleasure to spread through your penis into the rest of your body and expand. That way it's not isolated down there in your genitals and that way you have more to hold instead of just reaching the peak and then ejaculating. A lot of techniques from Tantra and Taoist sexuality, the goal of those is to really help you spread sexual pleasure from your penis into the rest of your body and breath is a huge way to do this. Most guys in my orgasmic mastery course, they say one of the most helpful things that really transformed their ability to even achieve non-ejaculatory orgasm is breath work, sexual breath work. So this is crucially, crucially important. Moving on to technique number four, make sounds of pleasure during sex. Most women make a lot of sounds during sex. Most men don't and we're missing out on the pleasure of sounds, but also on the utilitarian benefit of making sounds. Remember that ejaculation happens because tension is building up in the body and it grows and it grows and it grows and eventually we hit that peak and boom, it has to go somewhere. So it goes out through an ejaculatory orgasm. But if it's going up, going up, going up, and then you start uh, uh, making sounds like that, that is a discharge of energy. Your voice is a way to discharge the buildup of arousal, the buildup of sexual energy, and it will help you last longer. It's as simple as that. Technique number five is don't thrust so much during sex. Porn misleads us all. Most people really don't like thrusting that much. Instead, experiment with other kinds of movements like undulating, rocking back and forth, moving like the ocean. Thrusting is just a hyper stimulating thing for your penis and it's going to lead you towards premature ejaculation. If you are having sex with a woman, here's one to try. Take the tip of your penis and put it right at the opening of her vagina and then go in just a little bit and back out and a little bit and back out micro thrusts. Most women love this, not all, but most, because most women have a massive amount of pleasure nerve endings right there at the opening of their vagina and it can feel incredibly pleasurable for them. So if you do all five of these techniques, I promise you it will help you last longer in bed the next time you have sex. And if you want some lifestyle hacks to help you last as long as you want, anytime you have sex, check out this video right here and remember the decisions you make in all areas of your life even the next 10 minutes of your life are gonna impact your sex life. So check this out. I will see you in this next video.